Today I'm bringing you a little bit of cultural cooking with this German potato salad. So that's right, forget everything you know, forget that highlighter yellow side dish that barbecues and potlucks. This is where it's at. Here's the things that you're gonna need in order to make this delicious recipe. So first you're gonna wanna take two pounds of red potatoes and dice them into about one inch pieces. It doesn't have to be perfect, but you do want them to be close to the same size so they cook evenly. You're gonna place them into a stock pot and then cover them with water, just enough to get above the potatoes a little bit. Place it on your stove top and cook it on high. You're gonna want it to get good and boiling and then add a teaspoon of salt. You'll cook it about 20 minutes or until tender. Once it's ready to go, you're going to strain your potatoes and get all of the, the water out. Next up, you're gonna take 12 ounces of bacon. I like thick cut and you're gonna cut it into one inch pieces. You're gonna set a different pan on the stove Turn it on medium high, let it get hot a bit, and then add your bacon to the pan. You're gonna let the bacon cook and then remove it from the pan, leaving the grease in the pan. Next, you're gonna take a quarter cup of apple cider vinegar and add it to your grease. And one tablespoon of Dijon mustard. And three tablespoons of sugar. and half a teaspoon of salt. And pepper to your taste. You're just gonna mix that until it's well combined. So once you bring it to a boil, you're gonna add in one tablespoon of garlic. And just stir it in there. You'll leave it in the pan about 30 seconds to one minute. Then you'll turn off the heat. To your mixture, you're gonna add your potatoes that have been cooked and your bacon. And just give it a nice light stir. You don't wanna break up the potatoes, you just wanna incorporate that, that sauce with the potatoes. And there it is, isn't that gorgeous? You'll add a little bit of parsley, probably about half a cup, just to give it a little bit of a color pop on there. But oh my gosh, doesn't that look so much better than that yellow stuff? So good, so fresh, it's tangy and delicious. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel.